here we have a VC58 rifle, semi-automatic, and I'm going to a field strip it now. So first take off the magazine and make sure the weapon is safe to field strip by checking there's no round in the chamber and then fire the gun. On the left side of the gun there's a pin. You have to push it and then pull it out from the other side like that. And then you have to push the upper receiver so it comes off like that. It has a return mechanism in it. Then you pull the slide back and just lift it up. And there you got the bolt. First, take off the striker hammer from there, pull it out, and then turn counterclockwise, and then the rest of the parts come off itself, pretty much. Then, there's again a pin on the left side. You push it and pull it, and then you just lift off, lift off the handguard. And there you got the piston. You just take it off like that. and there's a spring for it. Then putting the ball back in together. It's quite easy once you do it a couple of times. First you put those parts together, uh, together and into the slide and then you are supposed to put the striker hammer thing a bit inside and then turn it clockwise and then it should go in like that. Putting the piston back in and the hind guard. Then this is the most hard, hard par part in assembling the gun again. Uh, you have to put the slide and the bolt correctly. It's it's very hard to do it fast but it goes there. The striker hammer leaves into back position so you have to fire the gun so it releases the striker hammer and you can push it back there. The lower spring goes to the striker hammer system and the other one goes to the slide. They are the return mechanism. Then you push the well, you just push the upper receiver back in and then push the back in. Make sure the gun still loads and shoots. Everything slides fine and fall 